Hello everybody, Cub Fan here uh, with a uh, video response to uh, Jerome and Yankees cards on top five Yankees cards uh, in honor of his 200 subscribers. So first off, Jerome, congratulations, 200 subscribers. That's a heck of a milestone. Uh, proud of you, brother. Uh, love your channel. I uh, love your content. Your Yankees collection is just absolutely ridiculous. One day when I grow up, I hope my Cub collection uh, uh, is as good as your Yankees collection because it is. I mean, it is sick, brother. So let's uh, let's get right into it. Um, I'm sad to say there are no Aaron Judge cards on my top five Yankee cards. Um, just because a uh, little thoughts on Aaron Judge is uh, I like how popular he is right now and I think he's going to be a stud but I think he's going to fall kind of in the lines of Adam Dunn that uh, he's just going to be a big bat and a big hitter and uh, he's going to be good for a couple of years but uh, you know he might flirt with the 400 home run club at some point but I don't think he's going to be much more than that. I don't know. I could be wrong. But that's just kind of my opinion. So Judge did not make my list. But who did? Uh, number five, the Yankee captain, Derek Jeter. Uh, this is his uh, 93 uh, Topps rookie card. Uh, just a sweet uh, card. It's, uh, in my opinion, it's kind of an iconic card. Um, I do not have the 93 SP. Uh, when I finally got around to where I thought I might get one, that it just kind of... I, I love Derek Jeter, but I mean, if I'm going to spend that kind of money, I'm going to get something a little bit more geared towards my PC than Derek Jeter. So at number four, we got the Donnie Baseball, his 84 Fleer rookie card. Uh, just a real pretty card. Don Manley can never go wrong with him. Um, wish he would have got a championship, but uh, I just, uh, I think his career fell a little short, but just a great he had a great start and uh, what could have been with him and so at number three we got chairman of the board Whitey Ford is a uh, 1960 tops he was just a iconic player really nice card and then if you're gonna have a Yankees list you gotta have Mantle and I don't have a great mantle, but I absolutely, this is one of my favorite cards in my collection, and my wife actually bought it for me. But it's got mantle, maze, and kill room. Trying to get the, don't want the shine in there, so you guys can see it. But uh, I absolutely love this card. 68 tops. And it's got three iconic players kill room, maze, and mantle. Just awesome. And then number one is, uh, I've mentioned this card in my top 20 cards in my collection, and this is the 60 Roger Maris, and the story behind this was when I was uh, deployed to Iraq, uh, you know, conversing with the wife through emails and, and stuff like that, I, I told her, you know, I admitted that, you know, that I just, uh, one thing I missed was I missed normalcy, I just, I missed the mundane things and and I miss like sitting in my room going through my cards and stuff like that so my wife went out knowing what I like and she got me this card and I mean it's not it, it's a it's a it's a nice card it's a 60 Roger Maris but I mean there's nothing absolutely fantastic about it but the the fact that she went out and she picked this up she went to the card shop and she picked this up and she sent it to me and that just meant the world to me and that was like the first time that she and our marriage which is we are celebrating 16 years today is our anniversary um, but she took you know she went out and did it on her own and went out and got this card for me and that was the first time she had done that and she's done it several times since then but this card always traveled with me anytime I deployed or anytime I went overseas or anything like that this card went with me because this was the card she got and with uh, me being the huge Cubs fan I am and the Cubs collection I have this is my most prized card in my collection because of her so uh, once again 
Congratulations, Jerome, on uh, 200 subs. I hope everybody had a great Thanksgiving. I know I did. I ate too much, and I probably shopped too much, and I probably spent too much money, and I probably drank too much. But that's why you get a long weekend to recover from that. So, uh, happy Thanksgiving, everybody, and congratulations, Jerome.